Hey guys, so it's here bringing you another video. Now today is hopefully going to be a pretty quick video. Knowing me it won't be. Uh, but it's going to be announcing a few things and explaining a few things. So the first big thing is the rebranding of the channel. Um, so the first thing to say is I'm still in Dignitas. Don't worry about that. I'm very happy in Dignitas. I love being in Dignitas. Uh, but I'll be explaining why did I decide to rebrand. So firstly, let's get the logo up on the screen. Kaboom, there it is up there. Uh, so it's the, the new cyborg lion, we can call it. Um, so I'm going to be quickly explaining why did I decide to rebrand, why did I decide to get a new logo. As if you're unaware, this was the old logo. I'm wearing the old shirt right now. Um, but yeah, basically there were a couple reasons. The first reason is uh, my brand identity, what you kind of have to imagine with YouTube, especially if you take it a little bit seriously like I do, this is still a hobby, but it's a little bit of a serious thing for me, is that you have to kind of treat your channel as a brand. And although I love being in Dignitas, and I see myself hopefully in Dignitas for a very long time, I think when I joined them, I became very excited being part of Dignitas, and I literally put Dignitas everywhere. I was like, theme that after Dignitas, theme that after Dign Dignitas. And I lost my own brand identity. I lost the Huzzy Games part of my channel, and it became basically a Dignitas channel. Kinda. It still had me, but that's what I felt anyway. And um, yeah, this rebrand basically has just sparked my brand off again, hopefully. Uh, that's the idea anyway. It's more for me than anybody else that I was like, no, I am Huzzy Games. Yes, I'm part of Dignitas, and I'm amazing, amazingly happy that I'm part of Dignitas. But I am my own thing as well. Um, so that's kind of one of the reasons why I rebranded. And then the second reason is this old logo here very much resembles Rengar. And I kind of wanted to take away from that. And I was like, I don't want my logo to be like, hey, that guy must be a Rengar main or something. So I was like, when I spoke to the artists that made this uh, logo, which I'll link in the description if you're interested. Um, I was like, I want to take away from that, but I want to kind of keep to the same theme. So I want it to be a cat because I love like big cats like tigers, lions, etc. And because this old logo is kind of like metally metallic uh, in his faceplate and stuff, I was like, how about we put a twist to that cat? So I decided on a lion as I love lions. And I was like, how about like a robotic cyborg feel for the lion? And that was it. That's all I gave them. A week or so later, they came back with this as a sketch. And they were like, what do you think? And I literally fell in love with it straight away. And um, yeah, I'm really happy with it. So the, the color scheme is blue. Um, obviously, we got the blue and white. But one thing to say, it is very easy, even for me, to change this color scheme for this logo. I'm not bad at Photoshop. Um, so if in a month or two time, I'm like, hey, I'm fed up with blue. Let's go to reds. Let's go to greens. I can easily change this myself. You know, it's a very easy fix. Uh, but for now, I'm very happy with the blue. It suits me, my back blue wall and everything. Um, so yeah, I'm happy. Uh, so they're kind of the reasons why I rebranded. That's the thought process anyway. Hopefully you guys really like it, um, as I definitely do. Now let's go into something a little bit more serious. That e that does go off this, um, and that is merchandise. So I'm not wearing this t-shirt just for a random occasion. This t-shirt is part of the Twitch Partner Program, which if I can show you the sleeve, there's the Twitch logo. Um, you only can have the Twitch logo on a t-shirt if you're a Twitch partner, and uh, yeah, you can sell t-shirts basically. And as a kind of celebration to this new logo coming out, um, I thought I'd release a new t-shirt, which will be very similar to this one. So you've got the logo on the front, you have Huzz Nation on the back, uh, and you'll be able to look further into that uh, t-shirt if you want to by clicking somewhere here or in the description. I'll put it somewhere, probably everywhere. Um, but yeah, if you want to buy one of those, that would be amazing. And here's the difference that I'm going to do. Uh, all the money that I potentially make from the sales of these t-shirts, hoodies, whatever you buy, I'm actually not going to just put it in my bank account, whatever. I'm going to put it uh, to the side as a mini fund to buying a new camera. Uh, as right now, I'm using a basic Logitech camera, a webcam, and it's very good for a webcam, but I want to get a proper 60 FPS video recorder for videos and if I go out and about on events and things like that. Um, so yeah, I'll use the money to buy a new camera, basically. So hopefully some of you like the new logo. Please let me know if you do. Uh, if you buy a t-shirt, make sure when you get it to take a picture of you wearing it. I have a little folder, which is a bit creepy, I know. But all the photos that people send me of them wearing the t-shirts, I have uh, a little folder on my desktop. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Please like it if you like the video uh, or the new logo. Subscribe if you haven't and share with a friend if you've got any friends. So I'll see you guys next time. See ya.